local listings. This is all about online directories, and there's tons out there. And I don't just mean ones built with Listing Pro, My Listing Themes, or something that someone has set up. I mean actual official ones, Yelp, Yellow Pages, or whatever loads of them are called now. Some of them you do have to pay for. They are premium, but there's lots of free ones as well. If you're very careful about putting a post out there, you are probably going to be found. And it might mean that you're getting your website out there as well, which can start to form bits of like interlinking back into your domain authority as well. The big mistake some people make though when they do an online listing submission is they go and put their company name. They kind of describe what they do, but they've almost missed out on their keywords or other keywords to help them. So they might say, yeah, we design websites and we're based in XYZ. Tell us a bit more about that. Think about your profile bio that you might have on Facebook, Twitter, or LinkedIn as well. Don't just say we design websites. What kind of websites? Do you have a starting price point? Do you work on WooCommerce or shop websites as well? And if you can get all of that into like 160 characters or less like that, make sure that forms the bio of when you submit to an online directory as well. I'm telling you now, okay, when I see a lot of online directory submissions like for hairdressers or photographers, they go and say, yeah, hi, I'm a family run business. We started off here. I really love photography and I hope I can help you out. What has that got to do with really selling yourself? It's like you're telling me, it's like you're talking to a relative. No, everything you do when you submit to an online directory or any form of listing, think of the elevator pitch, okay? You've got 20 seconds to tell me right now why I should give a damn about you and your business, okay? Think of it as your meta description.